Hey y'all, a little bit cloudy and nippy out. Oh Lord, that girl's always running. <laughs> well, Kimberly's here, y'all. <laughs> We've been out. Well, the chickens are running in the coop. <laughs> she done scared the chickens. I didn't mean to scare the chickens. <laughs> I just can't get used to all this. Well, space they're not used to here. somebody running through the corn. Wow, well, or... it's kind of hard not to with all this space. <laughs> you ever see a big open field and just want to take off running? No, I want to plow it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. <laughs> no, we just got done doing a little educational video for her second grade class. They're learning about seeds. Yes, and plants. This week, so it was good to. timing. Well, I'm gonna up, I'm gonna upload that on YouTube. We had a blast. It ran 20 minutes long, like 20 minutes. How did that happen? <laughs> but uh, it was fun talking, uh, talking to them. But I think we got our tomatoes healed up. We got just enough rain to get it wet out here. Uh huh. It didn't even register the video. Yeah. That's why we should have checked before we did the video because I was going to show them how much rain we got. And oh, right. And there wasn't anything and we're in like, there. Oh, well, it's wet. <laughs> <laughs> so we improvised. You'll but have it's to... enough to chase us inside, too. That's right. We actually had to put on our jackets. Oh, we did. Um, a little cold. 55 would have been a heat wave a few months ago, but mm -hmm. today it's a little cool. You, can't, you cranked up that uh, gas heater and we didn't want to come back outside. That's right. Oh, That's right. Y'all ever ease up to one of them? I think me and my mom got it the worst. She still does it to this day uh, with a little electric heater yeah. they got there. But Back up to it and hike your skirt up. <laughs> well, I ain't got a skirt on. Well, though. she does. <laughs> <laughs> but pull, pull up your old shirt, and then, right. then you got that ornery cousin that comes along and pulls your jeans <laughs> to your calves and burns you. Yeah. Right. Old rooster's on patrol oh, this afternoon. But uh, it's a little early in the afternoon, but Kimberly's going to be heading back to... Uh, spend the rest of the evening with mom and dad ahead of church tomorrow. They've got a big deal tomorrow at yes, our. Yes, they at, do. Uh, Is it friend friendship day or friends? Friend great day in the morning, I think. So if y'all, if nothing else, they got a. I think uh, the pastor said they have about two hundred slabs of ribs mm -hmm. and Brisket, as many chickens. They're gonna put a feed sausage, on tomorrow. Yeah, so. we nobody will go hungry. That's for sure. Yeah, I told them they need to send that big old yellow bus out and just put free ribs on it. They'd there get the you whole, go. The whole church would be <laughs> packed. But, I hope so. Yeah. That's out in Homer, Texas, Greater Love yeah. Tabernacle. If any of y'all in the area want to come out, and of course, me and Kimberly will be there with mom and dad. They've More been going, the better. going there for years, but it'll be a good time. And we'll be uh, in a rib coma tomorrow afternoon, oh, no. I'm afraid, <laughs> as much food as they got. <laughs> well, let's go out here. She wants to gather the eggs. We did yes, get a, I we got a few for the uh, education. I'm doing your job, Aunt Pat. I know you're missing it. And I don't think this is going to translate. No, uh, where's the camera? Yeah, you can't tell. We're uh, having the. It was really green. Maybe they can if we show them. Yeah, I think it's. I can't decide if it's a green or a blue one. So you've already got the ones out of there. Yep, yep. Look, there's another one going in there since we've been in here. Did I, so oh, they look. Yeah. I don't think I missed one. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I wish that. scared me to death. I'm sorry. Kimberly got too close to the laying hen on that one. I don't want to get pecked. I'm not going to bother you. <laughs> Oh, man. <laughs> that really scared me. Oh, my goodness. They lay till about 4 or 5 o'clock. Oh, there's one. Yeah. Oh, gosh. I just don't ever want to see a snake hold up in here. <laughs> well, you'll, he'll tell you if he's there. Mm. What would you tell me your friend told you that's a biologist that does a little snake rambling we'll about chicken snakes? That they're real bitey. <laughs> <laughs> real bitey. I, I don't like the sound of that. One got mom on this old place way back yeah, in the day. I remember that story when she was little. And yeah. uh, you hate to kill something just for living, you know, because they are, they do serve a purpose, even though I hate, I don't like snakes at all, but they just stay away. There's I'm another good. Easter egg. I'm not going to go close. You're not going to mess with anyway, it? Anyway, they said you really can't get rid of them other than just relocate them. Yeah. Nothing will deter them. Is that one laying right there, the way he's squatting? <laughs> I don't know. Mean I don't know. I don't sit out here and watch them lay. Oh, I didn't see that one on the yeah. ground. Yeah, good thing I was here yeah, again. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's not. Rude, there. there should be one back here. They're gonna be bored oh, to death with us gathering these eggs. Yep, yeah, there's one got a hidey hole back there. Oh, two. You got two big ones. Oh my goodness, they're warm. <laughs> that is so neat. They really are. Yeah. I ain't going to tell you what that means. They just come out the chicken butt. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's still cool. <laughs> still cool. Sorry, huh? guys. Uh, Stealing all your hard work. He's still squatting. I think he's got something coming out. <laughs> well, we're going to leave him do his business. Come on. 
It's got a little problem, as my grandma so, would say. Some some things in the barnyard have stayed in the barnyard. <laughs> I'm just saying. All right. We're gonna let that one stay in the barnyard. So you know, just where to look. They pretty much a routine about. Yeah, they're them. they're creatures of habit. If they're not laying in the nests, um, there's be a couple there later. They're they're working on it. But These big white ones lay on the ground. There should be a few in here. I see golf balls. Yeah, there's a couple on the bottom. I'm afraid I'm gonna get. <laughs> I gotta make sure I get it this time if it happens. That, yeah. that was not pleasant. Yeah. Alright. Alright. So egg gathering looks like about fifteen in there today. Yep. So see if we get out here in this light, then what oh, goodness, you probably got that on camera. <laughs> oh, no. You see the green one in the light? Yeah, I don't know if it's gonna show up in this camera. It sure looks see. green to me. I don't know. Alright. But uh had a good day out here though. Enjoyed spending a few hours with oh, you. Oh, we got to go show them what we did oh, over goodness. here in the shed real quick. Oh. We're going to have to get off here pretty quick because it's not going to freeze, but it's going to get cold enough. We'll probably get a light frost Monday morning. But uh, I'm going to have to take all these little. I wrote up for my peppers and all that, and I'm glad I paid attention to that moon calendar because I'd already had stuff in the ground had I not looked at it. Of course, I don't guess it knew anything about this cold front, but it worked out. You hope they're peppers, you know. I was doing some no. switcheroos out No, she there. come over here trying to, trying to switch, switch my labels up. <laughs> it's all right. The, <laughs> the joke's on her, old rascal. You gotta watch uh, this one. You'll never know. Uh, I will when I bite into it. <laughs> <laughs> but no, we'll take those inside. But y'all know it's been this. Uh, a lot of these outbuildings have just filled with junk over time. And uh, we got to treasure hunting, I guess, today. Yeah, because it was just heat full of stuff. Yeah, it was just heat full of stuff in here. We got it got it organized a little bit. But I wish you'd look at all these old bottles. Some of them ain't nothing but Miracle Whip bottles. But but it's been a long time since y'all seen one like that. But we'll have to get out here and clean some of these up. What'd you call this one? I remember my cold cream. Some kind of cold cream bottle. I <laughs> cold cream. Yeah, there's a lot of cool. A lot a milk and magnesia bottle. I just think those are so pretty. Curd and mason ones. jars. And yep. I believe that's an old Michelob one. I don't know what that's. Yeah. I don't know. Old I don't bottle. know what Raleigh, Raleigh's is. Ra Raleigh's? Yeah. Trade Trademark. Huh. I don't know. This is kind of cool, too. These are all just laid on the floor in here. Uh, at least they're picked up and you can walk in here now. That's right. And my goodness, at the scrap metal, uh, of course, all this is farm implements and tools. and It's been out in the weather for probably 30 years, so it ain't going to hurt for it to sit out here another night. But I'll go through here, and I guarantee there's a lot of cafes that would love to have that on the wall. All right. But, uh, just it's cool stuff. Lots of work has been done on this stuff, I guarantee you, at some point. Feels good to have that a little bit cleaner. Yep. It's not all, uh, got it all raked up, and then we'll have our morning glories will come up in this bed here and uh, hopefully climb that wall. So That's the plan. But <clears throat> but burning all the old stuff, and I'll get out here and straighten up this old iron and probably hang it around on some of these walls. Plenty of art, yeah, huh? Prop it up against a tree or something. Hey, I imagine their comment wanting to talk to you. They talk to me all the time. But let's go. Let's get still over here, and I'm going to hey, get off. Are you going to do what you call roll call? Roll call. Let's do roll call. <laughs> let's see here. Hey, are you going to let me say the last three words? I will let you say the last three words. All right. All right, let's see who all's on here now. If they don't comment, you can't read There's the green. Pat. You can't. Yeah, there you go. What? Oh, yeah, you did. Okay. There's oh. rules. Oh. Rule breaker. I, I really don't want to be a rule breaker. <laughs> All right, you got to do it. Kathy Reed says we're having fun. Yes. Yep. Susan Turner says hello, Joel. Have a blessed evening. And oh, hey, there's, there's our Lance. Lance. Hey, How Lance about it, buddy? Lot. My youngest Miss son. You. Yeah. All right. He just had a track meet, I believe, yesterday or today. Awesome. I got to call. I got to find out about what Very happened good. on that. So Let's I can't see. read them if they're in green. Right. Because they though. have to comment see though. <laughs> Kathy says, afternoon blessings. Blessings to you. Oh, yeah, Pat, I'm washing out for snakes. snakes. Mm. Brenda says, good afternoon. From oh, my it's her birthday. To read them, am I? Yeah, it's, uh, Brenda's in Arkansas. Yep, so it's being the 30s tonight. Yeah. Hey, Greg. All right. <laughs> I forgot I'm breaking the rules. <laughs> She's so breaking Sorry. the rules. Well, happy birthday to you, Miss Brenda. Yes, hey, Trudy. Yeah, there's Trudy. Margie. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Margie. Hey, they saw the green egg. Now All I need right, some good. ham. Yep. And then I'll, I can eat green eggs and green ham. Green eggs and ham. By Dr. Zoys. Sam, I am. 
Zeus. Zeus. He he's trying to make up that it uh, he went by Doctor Zeus. That's never heard. No, he no, didn't no. go by Doctor Zeus. That's not how you pronounce it. But that is how you anyway, pronounce it. Moving on. No. <laughs> Golly. Easy. Okay. Who hey Sharon. Hey. Green egg showed up. That's cool. All right, cool stuff. There's Brenda, Hi, Brenda. from Beckville. And Allie's Allie. in Central Texas. Central Texas and Ron. Ron. Hey, there's oh, Greg. Oh, he did comment, so I wasn't a rule oh, breaker. Oh, you saved her. You saved her on that one. <laughs> Pat said she followed <laughs> the rules for once, right? <laughs> hey, Good evening, Misty. Yep. How are you, ma'am? <laughs> she's she's having a, a few challenges and could use some prayers. And, All right. Um, nothing we can to, certainly lift you up. Nothing to disclose. Just some, some health challenges. So y'all right. y'all remember Misty in your prayers. Uh, Emily, Emily's in Tennessee. Tennessee. Food coming for green eggs works great. There you well, go. Well, we're getting them natural, though. Uh-huh. Yep. I'm going to sell those for $10 a piece. They're going to be upset when they open it up and it's not green inside. I guess I'll end up eating that one because I don't know if it'll sell for 10 Probably not. No. I could try. You could try. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think it's going to work. Dad's going to get me tomorrow. I already know it. For making you run through the pasture. Mm. <laughs> He'll get hey, you. I tried to remember. I said I, I didn't mow the yard. Uh -huh. I've been too busy in the garden. It had all them little wildflowers out there. I told you I was going to tell Dad that it's a wildflower protected oh. area. That's why I hadn't. <laughs> and I tried that awesome. the other day when he stopped by. He didn't fall for it. No. So, so I mowed the <laughs> yard this morning. They do have to go to seed, right? Yeah. But he didn't fall for it. He's mm -hmm. no. Anyway, maybe if it'd been on the highway. I, could I like go. that though. It seemed like a legit excuse to me. Dad said, no, that's nonsense. <laughs> so I had to mow the yard this morning. That's funny. <laughs> anyway. Well, I appreciate that. Well, well I did it for me, not weeds. for you. Oh, okay. Well, it looks nice. That's what we're going with. All right. We're going to sign off. Y'all have a great weekend. And uh, if you're around the, the Homer or Huntington area, outside of Lufkin on 69, might as well come over and eat some ribs with by. us tomorrow. Mm -hmm. I think it starts at 10. And, love to see you. Yeah, get fed by the... By the word from the pastor, and then we'll get go. get our belly full of ribs. And then nap time. Nap time for um, about four hours. There you go. <laughs> All right. Y'all right. have a uh, a good weekend, and I'll let Kimberly sign off with it. Everybody be the light. Sounds good. All right. Love y'all. Talk to you soon.